<laughs> Hi guys, I am very happy as you can tell right now Not because of the wine but because we are writing our guest list For our wedding and I am that sounds crazy. We started writing our uh, guest list tonight having a glass of wine and enjoying it i really want us to enjoy the process and i'm really happy and uh, i'm not gonna tell you the date but things are moving fast things are moving hi guys let's talk wedding related things um i got my wedding shoes well i ordered these um from macy's they're from this brand and they had a lot of different wedding shoes and i ordered these they are really really pretty as you can see i order in this color because i feel like it will go better with my dress and that's all i'm saying about my dress now here's the deal you see this heel it's a block heel i got this on purpose because i don't want to be uncomfortable the day of our wedding i want to dance a lot when i put them on it just they just feel uncomfortable and I don't know if I can dance in these the whole entire night like I want to. So you see, they're not that high. But all my weight is going to be held right here. And I don't know how I feel about that. So I actually went back to Macy's to try to return the shoes. Not return. I wanted to exchange them. But the only reason I got them now is because during my first dress fitting, I have to bring exactly the same shoes that I'm going to wear the day of the wedding. And they say that because that way they can see um, how much they need to alter the dress around, you know, the height that you're going to be that day, you know? Um, I know I can just bring another shoe that has the same heel, but I'd rather just have the shoes from now. So I went to Macy's to try to return the shoes and try to exchange them for another pair and I couldn't find another pair of shoes that I really liked. So I ordered a different pair and I just got it now and I want to open them on camera. So these are three and a half inches for the heel. And then the ones that I order the ones that I ordered are two and a half, I think. Which is very sh low for what i usually wear in heels to be honest with you i just want to party so i order the shoes from sapples i've never ordered from them before where can i put the camera because i don't want to put the, the box on the bed because you know this box has been on the floor and like different places and it's just icky to me okay. this is a brand for these shoes and their thing is that the bottom of these shoes are blue because if you ever heard um for brides that you should have something what is it something new something old something new something bar something <laughs> old something new something borrowed something blue so this would be my something blue and i ordered these in white because or ivory because that's the color that they had in my size you see, so this is a much different heel. I want to be comfortable. They're pretty. They're really pretty. That's what they look like. These look a little more sophisticated, let's say. But but also, my dress is really long. Like, I don't think anybody's going to see my shoes. They might see, like, the top of my shoe. And that's it. Oh, yeah, and here it is. The bottom is blue. It's like a turquoise blue. Let's try them on. Yeah, so these are way more comfortable. Like, way more comfortable. I feel like I can dance in these all night. Also, don't laugh at me because I have big feet, okay? I'm a size 9. I don't know how I feel because these are also really cute. Comfort or looks? What does it smell like? We're just waiting for the light rail to go return these shoes and we chose the day that it was raining.
<laughs> okay, so I returned the shoes and now we're trying to eat at a cheesecake factory, but there's a 30 minute wait and we're just sitting here and I'm so hungry. But yeah, today has been a very productive day. Hi guys, it's a new day and I have more things to show you. As you saw in the previous clips, I did end up returning both pairs of shoes because the first ones, like you saw, I love them, but they were uncomfortable. The second ones were comfortable, but I didn't really love them. So now the third pair is the winning pair. I know this is not as important, it's just shoes, but it's my wedding day and I want to love every single thing I wear. So let me just show you the new and final pair of shoes for my wedding day. So these are from the same brand as the first pair of shoes. These were definitely more expensive than both of the previous pairs. But I feel like it's worth it because I absolutely love these. And they're not only comfortable but they're also beautiful. They come with this little bag which I think is great because we are traveling and like... I don't know, maybe I'll feel like putting it in here to take them to the place or something like that. Look how beautiful these are. Look at the detail. They have crystals and pearls. And the heel is actually in between the other two. And they are so comfortable. And I, I'm, just, I'm just ready. I'm ready to wear these with my dress. Now that that whole shoe drama is solved, um, I had, uh, had another situation, um, this time with the wedding invitation envelopes that I order. I ordered three different kinds. Like, is this going to keep happening? Am I going to keep ordering three of each until I can find the perfect one? Apparently, the third one is always a charm because... Let me show you the, the, the envelope situation. Okay, so these were the first envelopes i ordered they actually look different on camera they look definitely more purple on camera like a little darker because in person they are very light and they're also very flimsy so i knew i wanted a lavender color for our wedding uh invitation envelope um when i ordered the invitations from minted they came with a white you know just a plain white envelope but i was like no i kind of want something you know lavender this was the first option i really thought about settling and just using this but i was like mm, not crazy about it and like i said i want to love everything that we use for the wedding so i went on i ordered these from amazon by the way so i went on amazon again and i ordered this one that's a, me a metallic one it's kind of shiny i don't know if you can really tell they're less flimsy they're a little more they're a little thicker but definitely too dark this is like purple purple you know like barney purple <laughs> and i i don't know like i wasn't a fan i was like okay this is definitely not the color so i stopped ordering from amazon and i ordered from this website called envelopes.com i think and we got the winner we actually got these that this is definitely the color that I was thinking about. It's like a, it's definitely a lavender color. And I also love this detail. Like, I think this looks way nicer than just a straight flat. So this is, this was the process. Number one, number two, and number three. So we are using these for our wedding invitations and they look amazing. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to return these dark shiny envelopes because um, I just, I spend what, like 20 something dollars on these. I know it's not a lot of money, but like if I'm not going to use it, I might as well return it. So I already printed the label for that. Well, my neighbors actually helped me print out the label because I didn't have a printer. <laughs> and I'm going to keep the really light ones because we might send thank you cards after the wedding. So I'm just going to hold on to those. Um... So let me get these prepared to return.
I have to put this inside. I already like double closed this. Done. Well guys, I'm just gonna end this video right here. I'm gonna drop that box in my mailbox so somebody can pick it up and I can get refunded. Thank you so much for watching this video and all my attempts at finding the perfect wedding items. Um, there's more videos to come. If you enjoyed this, please click that like button because that does make a difference and I keep saying it, but I don't see all of you doing it. Just before you end this video, just click on it. Don't forget to subscribe so you can watch all the other videos that are coming and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.